And the head of state governor, Mr. Godwin Abasaki, has said the state regional development and Benin City master plan will be backed by legislation to ensure strict compliance to the provisions of the plan and drive sustainable development of the state within the 30-year period. What we have done with this sensitization exercise is to begin to build the bridge between government, the way government is thinking, the, what government says is purpose, or purposes are, and the interests of the people. Um, and begin to make people see beyond the very short term into the long term, but because the medium to long term will soon come. The short term we already know about. So well, this exercise, during this exercise, we've shown to try to explain what we've done in the last seven and a half years, that there's, it's more like a teaser, more like the quick wins, what we could do as a government. We'll automatically behave and do things the way we have done. Let us have a document. It's not just going to be a public document. It's going to be a legislated document. It's passed into law by the House of Assembly. So it will be unlawful for governments or sections of government to do things that are outside of the plan. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.